guys, Shaber1000 here. Today, we're going to try this pizza that we got at the Dollar Tree, of course, for a dollar. It's uh, microwavable, but you can also put it in the oven. So, let's check this out and give it a quick review. Okay guys, it says it's microwave ready in three minutes, okay? I got the three meat, it's got sausage, pepperoni, and ham. Okay, keep frozen, cook, and serve, all right? This is only, uh, what is that, 7.2 ounces, 204 grams, right there. So, let's turn you over on the back, I'm going to give you a shot of this. That way you can pause it and read it if you'd like. And then here's the ingredients. Okay, so there's the conventional oven directions. Uh, you preheat the oven to 375, remove pizza from carton and wrapper, place on middle oven rack, bake 18 to 20 minutes or until cheese blend is melted try our other flavors they have those other flavors <coughs> i believe monkey got a different kind i believe she's going to do a review i'm not sure when but i think she's going to do a review on hers aren't you monk yeah yes yeah, so keep an eye out for her um this cooking instruction these cooking instructions were developed using a 1200 watt microwave oven with a rotating casserole or carousel which we have an 1100 watt isn't it? yeah 1100 watt it says remove pizza from carton and wrapper place pizza on a microwave microwavable safe plate microwave one pizza on high for three minutes if the cheese blend is not fully uh, uh, I looked away and now lost <laughs> if the cheese blend is not fully melted after three minutes cook for an additional time in 10 second increments on high power until cheese is fully melted then the last step is you let it stand for two minutes in microwave oven standing time is important for product quality okay well let's go ahead and open this up I mean it's a buck right now see to me this wouldn't you know I, I'll be able to eat this whole thing with no problem it is little I mean there's the you know I mean judge it from that um, let me grab a plate here's this is just a I know a lot of times things look bigger in on camera but um, this is just what is that this is just a regular uh, plate let's go ahead and open this up It's not as bad as I thought. Usually, you know, your toppings are all over the place. So this ain't too bad. Okay. Now we're going to go over here. We're going to stick it in the microwave for three minutes. And we'll see what we come up with. Okay, now we're going to let this stand for two minutes in the microwave, and then we'll take it out. Okay, it's been two minutes. What I like about this microwave is after it's done, after it it does its beep and lets you know it's done, after one minute, it'll beep. After another minute, it'll beep. So if something needs to sit in there for two minutes, I just wait to hear the two beeps. So it's pretty cool. So let's go ahead and take this out. Okay. Alright, let's get it over here and let's try it out. Okay, we got it out here. I probably could have went a few more, like another 10 second blast, maybe 20. I see a little bit of cheese here. It's not quite melted, but I think it'll be alright. I want to try this thing. I think I did a review on this. I'm going to see if it'll cut pizza. If you like, if you like crunchy pizza, 
you might not like this, but I like my pizza where it, see the bottom. Yeah, it kind of turned brown a little bit. It probably would be better in the oven as with any kind of pizza. I brought this over here just in case that other one didn't work. I'm gonna let this cool down a minute and then I'm gonna give it a, a taste. Okay guys, let's give this a shot. It's still hot. I let it set probably about two more minutes to cool down. I'll tell you what, for frozen pizza, for a dollar, I, it gets a two thumbs up from me. It would even been better in the oven, which I should have did, but I thought I'd try it microwave. I mean, it's okay, but it probably would, like I said, be the crust would be a little crispier. But mm. for a dollar, I will buy more of these. This is good, like lunch for me when I come in from the garage. I just want something. To snack on and get back to whatever I'm doing there in the shop. It's fine for that. I don't think it'd be feasible to buy if you got five or six people to buy five or six of these. I mean, just you know, go over to the pizza shop and get you a pizza, you know. Um, but to have on hand just for a quick snack or something while you're watching TV perfect for that so yeah it gets a two thumbs up for a dollar what the hell right so anyway guys thanks for watching i appreciate it and uh stay tuned for more awesome videos like this remember please please uh comment rate and definitely subscribe and hit that bell icon so you can get notified of more videos like this also if you did not like this video hit the thumbs down button twice just to show me that you didn't like it. Then I'll know where to improve on. <laughs> Shea Bear, the myth, the man, legend. I'm gone for now. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye. Enjoy the rest of your weekend. Appreciate it. We'll see you soon.